you want to host a webinar and you want to use this webinar as a replay in super high quality. Now I'll show you how to make the right settings for that. First of all, you of course have your interface where you create a new meeting and here you can set the basic information for the meeting. For example, what the meeting is called, which day it takes place. Let's say the end of November on my birthday. Then here you have the option to enter a password. That's a security solution and it's usually recommended. Then we have the options here, which are really important to look at. The options here at the bottom are also really important to check out. Here you can say that you automatically record the meeting and then I would recommend that you record to the cloud. This means that the quality is also better. If you record right away, you avoid forgetting this in the heat of the Zoom meeting. With allow participants to join anytime, you give everyone the option to join the webinar later. Definitely a good method for maintaining focus within the meeting. Next, you have the mute participants upon entry option. It's critical that when participants join, they're immediately muted, preventing any disruption or shifting focus among the other participants because they log in there. There's something else that's important. By default, Zoom always provides the gallery overview as a recording option. Many people use this gallery view and are then surprised that they don't actually need it. So it's really important to alter settings in the beginning to avoid any unwelcome surprises. That's the way it goes. To do this, you go to the recording settings at the top of the settings menu. And here's what's crucial. So normally this option is set here in cloud recording, as we've indicated. Gallery view, that's the default setting. However, that's a bit difficult if you don't want to show participants or if you want to use this video later. Therefore, I wouldn't recommend this option at all. Instead, I would recommend you to go here. Record active speaker with shared screen. That way you'll always have the active speaker here. So mostly you who's sharing your screen. If you wanna be on the safe side, there's also this option here. Record active speaker, gallery view, and shared screen separately. That means you'll have the active speaker, the gallery view, and the shared screen here. Well then, that way you really can play it safe. You now have more recordings stored in your cloud, but you definitely have the option to exchange something, edit something later. You're much more flexible, so you'll have your voiceover video completely separate from any other perspective. Oh, and last but not least, I would like to give you the following idea. You can find them at audio conferencing. If you click here, it'll ask if you want to display the international numbers for the invitation email. You usually don't need international numbers. So just turn it off and you will have a much easier invitation text and you don't have to edit anything anymore. Another question. Have you ever wondered why your Zoom videos look blurry? That's because Zoom limits your recording quality to 360 pixels by default. It's definitely more space saving and most people don't need it bigger. But you can enlarge your video quality up to 720 pixels to HD quality for free. To do that, you simply need to do one thing, write to Zoom support and express your wish. And I describe how to do that successfully live on my website. Here you can easily get instructions. Here's what it looks like. Go to the blog category. Here's the post about Min HD. This will give you a better resolution and show you exactly where you need to write and how to formulate your request. This will give you an excellent resolution for your next webinar, which you can then really share and upload to others in HD quality. I hope you enjoy this and get in touch if you have any further questions. Hi, this is Daniel from Live Broadcasting Rocks. 
Today, it is simply essential to master video and audio. If you are an entrepreneur, lead a virtual team or work as a coach, you know, with a high quality presence, you are the leader you want to be. You convince, you sell and you also feel better. That's why I have created my personal guide on how to easily set up your own video and audio equipment. Here you will find my selection of the best microphones, webcams, useful resources and practical examples. This guide is made to save you time and money. I worked with and tested all of the equipment myself. Download my free equipment list now at www.bit.ly slash EQL2024 or scan the QR code. Use your creative potential and become visible with high quality video and audio. Have fun creating. I look forward to seeing you live.